the standard cost of the material is 200 so the 200 you are writing for the 20000 as per the management standard okay so which is coming under the fixed the respected unit if you divide 760000 divided by 16000 the rate per administration expense okay 47.50 if you try to increase 1% the rate per unit 80.80 into 16,000 unit 12,92,800 we are getting. Hello everyone, a warm welcome to one and all. I am Natesh, lecturer in commerce, Vidyashram First Grade College, Mysore, the temple of excellence. We are in the unit 5, session 4, fourth semester BCom, costing methods and technique. And the chapter name is budgetary control and standard costing and today my agenda the flexible budget uh, related problem okay so in the last session problem which is based on the flexible and today there is one questions to understand much more you will get more clarity so the expense for the production 20,000 units in the factory are given below so the material is 200 uh, labor cost is 80 variable production over at 60 a fixed overhead so 40 and administration expense 5% to only applicable for variable remaining 95% which is going for the fixed and selling expense 20% fixed remaining 80% will which is coming under the variable and next one distribution expense 10% fixed remaining 90% will go for the variable so here the total cost of sales is given 464 profit for unit 120 is given selling price per unit 584 so you are required to prepare flexible budget for the production 16,000 and 24,000 so what they specified in the question which is coming under the standard okay the standard management or fix okay so which is comparing uh, fix uh, 20,000 which is a uh, fix Okay, we are comparing for 16,000 and 24,000 units. So, there is uh, at uh, 16,000 units, the raw material cost decreased by 2%. So, at the time of uh, when you are writing uh, 16,000, 20,000, 24,000, so only 16,000 raw materials want to reduce. The raw material cost is 200, which is uh, reducing 2%. Okay, and the labor cost increase uh, 1%. So under 16,000 unit capacity when you are doing, so 1% you have to show for reducing in the labor cost. So the remaining two capacity which is a constant. Now at 24,000 unit selling price fall 5%. 5% the selling price is 584 is given. When you are doing for 24,000 unit, so only remaining there is no changes. Okay, moving forward. So what you need to do, you need to draw the format. One is particular. There are three capacity we have identified. One is 16,000. Under 16,000, two column. One is rate per unit and amount. Again, 20,000 units. So which is a standard, which is a standard or you can call it as a fixed budget. Okay, so which is fixed budget. And 16,000 and 24,000, which is completely coming under the flexible budget. So here, uh, 20,000 rate per unit amount. Uh, next to 24,000 units rate per amount. The first one will start from the variable cost uh, using the marginal statement. Uh, we are doing for a consolidate problem. Okay, we are not doing separately. So consolidate. So under variable cost, the first one material, I have written 2%, there is adjustment uh, because uh, adjustment uh, which is related to the 16,000 units only. So 2% decrease in the material cost. So the standard cost of the material is 200. So the 200 you are writing for the 20,000 as per the management standard. Okay, so which is coming under the fixed. Uh, so this one is a flexible budget, completely flexible budget. So we are comparing with the 16 and 24,000 what exactly the rate are varied. Here the 200 into 2%. So the remaining value try to subtract 2 rupees. 196 the rate per unit under 16,000 unit. So 196 into 16,000 if you multiply. So 31,36,000 we are getting. Okay next under 20,000 units there is no changes for the material cost uh, the adjustment is applicable for only for 16,000 units. 
So 200 into 20,000, 40 lakhs we are getting. And then the same thing, the rate is applicable for, there is no changes for 24,000, only which is applicable for 16,000 units so reduced 2%. So 200 into 24,000, 48 lakhs we are getting. So moving to labor, so there is one adjustment to 16,000 units. So 1% increase in the material. So actual the labor cost is given for original, 80 rupees which is given in the question. If you try to increase 1%, uh, the rate per unit 80.80 into 16,000 unit, 12,92,800 we are getting. So here the same thing, 80 into 20,000, 16 lakhs. Okay, 80 into 24,000, 19 lakh, 20,000. Moving to the next item, variable production overheads. The variable production overheads, uh, which is the rate is given in the question 60. Now 60 into 16, 16,000, 9 lakh, 60,000. Again, 60 into 20,000, 12 lakhs. And 60 into 24,000, 14 lakh, 40,000. Now moving to the administration, only a variable which is applicable for 5%. So here the 5%, the rate what you are calculating, the rate is given variable over its 60. Okay, now 5% you are taking means the rate you are getting 2 per unit, 2 into 16, 32,000. Again, 2 into 20,000, 40,000. 2 into 24,000, 48,000 we are getting. So moving to the next item uh, which is given in the administration expense, uh, only 5%, 40. Okay, now 5%, 42. So again, the administration expense when you're calculating, uh, the 5%, the rate is uh, 40 into 5% if you calculate 2 rupees. Uh, so the same thing. Now moving to the, uh, there is one more item, variable pro or it's completed. Next one, selling expense. Okay, there is one item selling expense 20% which is coming under the fixed day, uh, remaining 80% which is coming under the variable. So 80% uh, the rate is applicable in the question, uh, the rate is specified uh, selling distribution 24 rupees. Now 80% you, you need to calculate 80% for into 24. Okay, so 19.20 into 16,000 units, 3,7,200. So again, 19.20 into 20,000, 3,84,000 we are getting. Next, 19.20 into 24,000, 4,60,800. So moving to the next one, uh, uh, total cost. Okay, total cost of the sales. So here 464 is given. Okay, now 464 the total so doing this well uh, variable once you identify once you calculate now you need to take the total for variable all the items. Okay, finally we are getting uh, the rate total and amount rate per unit total amount. So for all the capacity. Okay, here we are getting 376 uh, and 60 lakhs, uh, 16,000, under uh, 20,000 capacity we are getting uh, total variable cost 379.20, the value 75 lakhs, 84,000, the rate for 24,000 units 379.20, okay, now finally uh, 91 lakhs, 800 we are getting. So just for your understanding, I have written whatever we calculated the total variable cost uh, just for uh, taking the total. So I have copied one more time the total variable cost whatever we calculated I have written. Okay, so moving to the fixed cost. Again, we need to identify which is coming under the fixed. Uh, okay, which is standard. So and uh, we are comparing with the 16,000 and uh, 24,000 units. The second category, the fixed cost. Under the fixed cost, there is a production overheads is given. So the production overheads rate directly is given in the question, uh, okay, 40. So the 40 which is coming under the directly, we need to consider for the 20,000 units. Uh, so 20,000 in units into 40 into 20,000, 8 lakhs we are getting. So 8 lakhs. So here the same fixed cost cannot be changed for any capacity increase or decrease. So again the same thing, the 40 how we are getting the same thing, the 40 the, which is a standard for all the three category. Now here the 40 how we are getting, 40 into 20,000, 8 lakhs we are getting. This 8 lakhs you need to write for all the category first, the amount total column, the total amount 8 lakhs, 8 lakhs which is a fix for all the capacity. So 
8 lakh divided by 16,000 if you divide you are getting the rate per fixed cost will be 50. So in case of 24,000 the fixed cost value which cannot be changed right. So 8 lakh divided by 24,000 units 33.33 uh, rupee. Now moving to the administration expense the 5% we consider for variable the remaining 95% which is coming under the fixed okay. So 38 uh, into 20. 1000, 7 lakh, 60,000, we need to write for both, okay, capacity, 16,000 capacity and 24,000 capacity. The respected unit, if you divide, 7 lakh, 60,000 divided by 16,000, the rate per administration expense, okay, 47.50. Here also same thing, 7 lakh, 60,000 divided by 24,000, if you divide, 31.67 we are getting. So, moving to the selling expense, so 80% we consider for variable, the remaining 20% only we need to write in the fixed cost. Now 20% the rate is uh, 4.80. So 4.80 into 20,000, 96,000. So 96,000 which is applicable for all the capacity. Here also we are writing 96,000 and here also 90,000. Why? Which is a constant. The fixed cost will be always constant. 96,000 divided by 16,000, 6 rupee uh, we are getting and here 96,000 divided by 24,000, the 4 rupees uh, rate we are getting. So moving to the distribution expense, 10% uh, only we consider for the fixed uh, cost, so which is clearly specified in the question. So if you calculate the rate, uh, the 2 rupees we are getting, so only 10%, 90% which is going for the variable. So 2 into 20,040. The 40 will applicable for 16,000 as well as 24,000. If you divide 40,000 divided by 16,000, 2.50 we are getting. Whatever the 40,000 divided by 24,000, if you divide the same thing, 1.67 we are getting. So moving, now we need to take the total for fixed cost total. So all together till here, okay. So from production overheads to distribution overheads, the total we are getting total fixed cost uh, 106. Okay, the total amount called 16 lakhs 96 thousand. So like this, want to take for total for all the capacity. So once you took the fixed cost total, immediately we need to take the total cost. Okay, adding variable cost plus fixed cost. Adding variable cost. Okay, A represent variable, uh, B represent for uh, fixed cost. So now 376 plus 106, we are getting 482, 60 lakh 60,000 plus 16 lakh 96,000, 77 lakhs to 12,000. So again, same thing, 379.20 plus 84.80, 464. Okay, now moving to next. 75 lakhs 84,000 plus 16,000 96,000 if you add together 92 lakhs 80,000 we are getting. So here next one 379.20 plus 70.67 if you add 449.87. So last one 91 lakhs 800 plus 16 lakh 96,000 if you add 1 crore 7 lakh 96 thousand. Once we get the total car, okay, now there is one adjustment uh, which is related to 24,000 capacity in the question, they clearly specified. So there is a 5% uh, decreasing in the 24,000 selling price only which is applicable for 24,000 because adjustment, okay. So here the normal selling price uh, uh, which is given in the question uh, 584, okay. So 584 into 16,000. 93 lakhs 44,000. Okay, the same rate we are writing. There is no changes for 20,000 also because adjustment which is applicable for only for 24,000. So 584 into 20,000, the value whatever we are getting. Next one, there is a slight decrease, 5% decrease because adjustment clearly specified 5% reducing the sell price. So the normal selling price is a 584. If you try to reduce 5%, Center, the value we are getting 554.80. So you need to multiply 24,000 unit. So the value 1 crore 33 lakhs 15,200. Now what we need to do to find out the profit, the profit is given in the question. Okay, so 120. 
120 for the standard whatever the information we need to calculate based on the 20,000 either 16,000 or 24,000 the profit is given in the question okay so 120 120 how we are getting here the sales minus so total cost the same answer we are getting 120 120 into 20,000 24 lakhs we are getting so in this case 554 minus so 482 if you subtract um, the difference we are getting that is actually 102 okay so the value if you multiply 16,000 unit 16 lakh 32,000 you are getting next moving to 24,000 the same thing here after subtracting to a sales value there is a decrease value 554.80 minus 449.87 if you subtract the difference we are getting 104.97 into 24,000 units 25 lakhs 19,200 we are getting so calculation I have specified for the last 24,000 selling price uh, reducing here yeah? actual selling price standard which is applicable only for 20,000 okay so the rate is given for 584 which is there in the question so now uh, this adjustment which is applicable for only for 24,000 units capacity so less 5% if you reduce uh, 29.20 if you subtract the value of the uh, reducing price will be okay 554.80 so this is the capacity the selling price will applicable for so I have specified here the rate keep on watch for next section thank you